Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to explain how to create a simple data entry form using Max of Actual. So, for example, you have the variable names like serial number, age, and then gender, and then let's say pass fail. Okay, so for example, this is the simple form. Now, what we have to do is you select that particular variables. And then you go to insert and then go to table and here it asks you whether your table has headers so my, you, you select that my table has headers and then click on okay so what you have to do now is you select the variables you go to file and then click on options okay <coughs> and then select customize ribbon okay customize ribbon and then create a new tab okay you can create a new tab over here and then you rename the group within that new tab by right click um, by doing the right click on that particular group click on rename and let's name this group as form one okay click on okay now you see that form one has been created and then now you select commands not in the ribbon here and on the bottom you can see form okay you select that particular group and then drag this form on the right to click add you see that the form has been added and then click on okay so now what happens is that you see the new tab button in Excel click on that new tab and then click on form okay click on form now you can see that the form is being created here in serial number type 1 click tab or use the mouse to go to the next field and then select age into the age gender let's say male and then pass fail let's say pass click enter you see the data is being entered serial number 2 is 34 gender female pass fail fail hit enter so when you keep on entering the data you see that it's being updated okay so that the data sheet keeps on being updated so if you want to make changes you can go to the particular record so you go to the first record let's say you want to make change um, in the age of the first record from 12 to 13 then select 13 make sure that you have you are in the first observation and then click on enter you see that the age is being changed okay similarly you can edit the second observation but if you want to add the new record drag this all the way to the bottom select 3 and then age let's say 35 general mail and then pass fail let's say pass so in this way you can enter the data making a simple form in max of actual hope you liked it um in the coming videos i'll be making more advanced uh, uh, i'll be showing um uh, videos on more advanced feature in max of actual so if you like the video please share it with your colleagues and uh, also to leave your comments below to give your constructive feedback bye bye and see you in the next tutorial cheers